And the reason we are gathered around is because of this gadget right here. That's amazing. The inside, the inside that steak is already 70. That is fast. Is it? Oh, hot, oh, hot, 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 hot. Hot but delicious. Our steak was pretty much at the maximum height. You don't need any more stress in your life. And there's a camera inside so you can monitor on your smartphone. 14 minutes and 10 seconds with the potatoes. There's no way those potatoes are cooked. Wow, who would've thought we had a cooking show? Before we get into today's video, I wanna mention that this kitchen gadget we're gonna be looking at is gonna be on sale. It's coming up very soon for Black Friday, around Black Friday. It doesn't go on sale often. Stick around to the end to get all the details. The studio's been transformed into a cooking show. Hooray! Cue the audience noise here. There's potatoes on the table. There's some steak on the table. Bake or don't bake cookies over there, which Jack picked out, and I think you're gonna get a kick out of them. I've never even seen anything like it before. And the reason we are gathered around is because of this gadget right here, a kitchen gadget. It's called the Brava, and this is like a new type of oven. Uh, it's, it's hard to even call it an oven because of, I mean, it's an oven, it cooks things, but it has a completely different approach. It cooks with light and in different sections and segments. Fill up a tray like this one or a tray like this one, one, two, three, with a variety of food items. And instead of heating the whole thing up like the same, it can cook each ingredient independently depending on what it is. So if you had broccoli up here on number three, you had steak down here on number one, obviously they have different cooking requirements. It can do that on one tray all at the same time. There's an app that goes with it with a variety of uh, existing recipes, but you can of course just throw in whatever you like. And it's fast. For me, that's key. This thing is speedy. It's like a grilled cheese in a couple minutes. It's like potatoes in less than half the time of what it would take in the oven. And there's a camera inside so you can monitor on your smartphone everything that's happening with it. This temp sensor is gonna ensure that everything is cooked exactly properly. So like for the steak, we'll just put in medium rare and be confident so we're not gonna screw up our $20 steak. And inserting it is, is pretty straightforward. As you can see, you just slide it into the side of uh, what well, could be a steak, it could be uh, chicken, it could be whatever it is that you might have to monitor the temperature for. So open it up, there's tray area. So there's a lower and upper tray. Couple of instructions here for, for how to do one of these combination trays as far as filling the tray up. And then on the back, a variety of things you can do on here. And pretty wild, you can cook a pizza in here. You can do eggs in here. Obviously steak and potatoes is what we have. You can bake in here. You can do breakfast in here. You can use the app, you can use the touch screen here. It even has a sear functionality which I'm excited about because obviously when you're cooking something like steak, it's important to have that ability. All right, I think we should just call Will over because he's very excited and interested in this device. He's the type of guy that could really take advantage of this, right? This would be suitable for you, wouldn't it? Yeah. You could, you could do a whole meal on here. Yeah. Like you could do chicken wings. I don't know what type of thing you like to do, but. Definitely wings, definitely roasted potatoes. This is Will Do, ladies and gentlemen. That's Will Do, ladies and gentlemen. This is your temp sensor. It connects on the inside here. Almost plugs in like a, like a USB almost. And then this is gonna go into our steak. We're gonna put that right in there. It can do up to a two inch steak. Let's put the steaks to the side just for a moment. Let's uh, uh, get some potatoes going. He goes, just head over to the grocery store there and pick up uh, you know, one of those potato melodies. <laughs> I was so confident. <laughs> it's like, you mean medley, right, Will? Now, potatoes in the oven, they take forever. One thing we don't have here is uh, like any type of oil or fat. Like we don't have any yeah, uh, yeah. butter or oil of any kind. So we're kind of missing that, but you know what though? Can we actually get the fat from the beef? Talk about McDonald's french fries, a little beef fat in there, beef tallow. Yeah, just, uh, just cut a part of that and then put it in there. It'll kind of soak into it. Willie do. Ladies and gentlemen, this guy's been around town. He's been around the block. That's what I'm saying. So, Will, let me explain to you that why this is going to change your life, okay? Okay. Because as it stands right now, you're uh, you're taking too many risks. The way With you're crypto. <laughs> this is all about stability. You monitor. You leave the kitchen. You just throw it in. You forget it. You just leave it alone. Right, yeah. You don't have to worry. Yeah. It's it's on your phone, you're getting the notification, you got the probe in there. 
you know how that is. You don't need any more stress in your life. Doing a little something like this. So I'm just gonna yeah. scoop a few of these on there. Just right, too much, too little. Mm -hmm. We're close, we're close for sure. Okay, all right, here we go. Oh, that's salt, ladies and gentlemen. Mm. Here we go. A little that. salt on a potato, we'll take it. A little pepper on a, on a potato. Oh, the pepper smells great. Yeah. You know, it's underappreciated, the type of like, just a typical spice. Sure, yeah. It's yeah, underappreciated, because yeah. it's like, it's on everything, but. Yo, what even is our cooking show? I'm, try, I'm having trouble pinpointing. It's like regular. It's very regular. We're yeah. regular people figuring things out. It's not, po you know, the normal tap dance type thing to it. Yeah. I'm just very aware of just me standing here with like a jacket and just like staring over <laughs> you making potatoes. I don't know how much we're going to do here. I'm going to just tap a little bit here. It, I think it's steak time. So inside the app, you can pick, I mean, such a variety of recipes. There's even like videos in here and stuff too. Pick what you wanna cook, including these combo plates. So I'm just gonna click on search over here. If I just type in steak, let's say, here we go. New York strip and potatoes. These are fingerling potatoes. We cut those potatoes, I think it's okay, no? New York strip steak, one and a quarter to two inches thick. This is two inches. Yep. Salt, it wants cooking oil. Gonna have dry potatoes. Place steak in zone one. We did that. Those potatoes might get stuck. It says you're supposed to toss them with oil. Okay, metal tray goes into the top shelf. Can I just send this to the send to my Braba? Oh yeah, ch check it out. Look at that. Goes straight over here. So I'm looking, picking what I want to cook, and then it see it sees the steak in zone one and the potatoes in two and three. Okay, I'm gonna close it up here. This is says a 10 to 17 minutes. Wow. So this is where you choose your preferred level of doneness from medium rare up to well done. We'll keep it at medium rare. Picture comes up. Whoa. Oh, that's a steak right there. Wow. Crazy. Will, come check this right now. Mmm. You see the temperature, 53, go up to 120, look. I think we can, can we see it on the phone too? Oh, look. Come on, man. Mm. Now you're on the couch hanging out. I'm just drooling. Yeah. <laughs> so satisfying. Yeah. I can already smell the steak cooking. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Starting to cook all right. Oh yeah. That's amazing. The, the inside, sizzling. Inside that steak is already 70. And you ever barbecue like with a meat thermometer? Mm, no. That is fast. Is it? Yeah. And that's hard to achieve in your house when you just got the flapping around with your pans. This guarantees it. Like the steak has slowed down. It went went up to 90 Fahrenheit really fast, then slowed. And just with my nose, I can tell it's working on the potatoes now and bringing them up to the level of the steak. It's a really kind of cool ability. It's being really careful not to overcook the steak. Right? It wants to hit exactly 120 and not more. Yeah. Very granular. It only wants to go up one degree at a time. Target 120, medium rare, 14 minutes and 10 seconds with the potatoes. There's no way those potatoes are cooked. Open door, check your food before continuing. I mean, it smells, obviously smells delicious. Oh man, that's a, that's a serious steak right there. Mm -hmm. I mean, the potatoes look cooked. Anything can happen here. I think it's good. Actually, that looks really good. Pretty top high. to bottom, it's actually pretty even. Mm -hmm. You said medium rare, right? This is medium rare, yeah. I was wondering if it's gonna cook top and bottom equivalently. You see that? It does. I'm gonna just try a piece. Obviously, a lot of it is a cut that he sure. bought to begin with, but I love it. I mean, I mean, I obviously I understand like. The way we did this video is bare minimum. Like we literally slapped a piece of meat on it and some potatoes without oil. Mm, that's a steak right there. That's really good. The convenience of it is kind of amazing. We moved the potatoes over onto the oil and did a quick little top up. And this is this, the key to getting the oil in there. Now you could use obviously olive oil or something like that, but it's a key. Mm. Oh, I heard the front. Mm -hmm. Oh, hot, oh, hot, 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 hot. Hot but delicious. Is that? Cookie? Cookie, yeah. 
I mean, a lot of this has to do with just monitoring with a probe or some sort of a temperature check. But the problem with those is you're not going to leave it in the whole time. You definitely don't have a camera and everything is not enclosed and contained. And like, how can you get that evenness top to bottom? I like to see the things that are baking, their progress. No, didn't you, when, when you were a kid, did you not sit in front of the uh, oven mm -hmm. if your mom ever was baking something and you would like look in, you turn the light on? Like it's almost ready. I didn't even know Lucky Charms cookies existed. Smells good. Way crunchier on the bottom than I expected. I'm a little concerned. I'm gonna be too gooey, especially this cookie. Some type of Lucky Charms cookie here. But no, it hasn't crunched to the bottom. Mm hmm. Very pleasant. <laughs> mm hmm. That's what you want in a cookie. Soft top, crunchy bottom. Mm hmm. You did it. Steak, potatoes, cookies, whatever you want to eat. You do it in the oven, you do it with precision, you do it with efficiency, you do it with better speed. That is honestly my favorite part. Because of how high powered these lights are, you're getting things that typically take a long time, you're getting in a shorter period of time. So I like that. All right, so a little bit more about the holiday season deal that Brava is doing. They're offering up to $300 off Brava packages between Monday, November 15th and Sunday, December 5th. This is their best sale of the year. So the starter set gets 100 off. The bake and breakfast set gets 200 off and the chef's choice set gets $300 off. You can check those details in the description as well. There's also another color. Depending on your decor, you can get the, uh, the black model as well. Equally pleasing. Yeah. This is the type of thing. It's not like a normal sound. It doesn't sound normal. <laughs> Sounds a lot more aggressive. <laughs> All right, so, uh... <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not coming out. Where's it going? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> You're supposed to grind and come through, unless there's a seal. Oh, there must be a seal of some kind. Uh-oh. I think I might have screwed this one up. Uh -oh. Yeah. oh, that's salt, ladies mm. and gentlemen. Here we go. A little that. salt on a potato, we'll take it. <laughs>